Welcome to this module about Employee Florida Online Jobs Portal. This presentation is Lesson 1, an introduction to the Employee Florida system. Hello, I will be walking you through the Employee Florida module. Several modules look as though they, you are working in the Employee Florida system. Do not worry. These are simulations and are designed to give you the look, feel, and functionality of the system. Follow the prompts to move forward. Employ Florida is Florida's official labor exchange system. Employers can enter information into the system about job openings that we call job orders. Employers can also look for candidates in the system if the job seeker's information is posted for employers to search. Job seekers can look for jobs and sometimes apply for those jobs right online. The Employ Florida system is designed to help bring employers and job seekers together. What is a job opening? A job opening is a job vacancy that an employer intends to fill. What is a job order? A job order is a structured record of an employer's requirements for filling a vacant position with a qualified worker. A job order must include several elements, including the qualifications that a worker must have to perform the required duties. Additionally, a job order must include information about the job or jobs, as well as information on how to apply for the job. Job orders are entered into Employ Florida by either the employer or the Local Workforce Development Board, or LWDB. There are three types of job orders posted in Employ Florida. There are unsuppressed job orders, suppressed job orders, and staff view only job orders. Unsuppressed job orders are visible to the public and allow information to be seen on how the job seekers can apply for the job. Suppressed job orders are also visible to the public, but information on how to apply for the job is not visible to the job seeker. Staff from the LWDB are required to pre-screen job seekers and refer appropriate candidates to the employer when appropriate. Staff view only job orders are not visible to the public through the Employ Florida system. In fact, job seekers looking for work in the Employ Florida system will not see any information about these jobs. The LWDB is required to tell candidates who meet the employer's needs about the job, pre screen those candidates, and refer candidates to the employer based on the employer's instructions. So, why is this really important? How the job order is coded impacts your job seeker customer's ability to apply for the job. Job seekers can use Employ Florida to look up information about job openings located all over the state. If job seekers have a profile and resume in the Employ Florida system, job seekers can send employers their resumes. Employers can look up and see what type of candidates are looking for work, as well as Look at labor market information in the Employ Florida system. If the employer wants to look up information on a specific candidate or post a job order in the Employ Florida system, they must create a profile. Employers who are registered in the Employ Florida system can search through information to find job seekers who have skills, education, and other characteristics the employers are looking for. If the job seeker has created a profile, a detailed background, and a public resume in Employ Florida, the employer can search for and review information about the selected candidate. For example, you are working with the manager of a hotel who is looking for a job seeker that has hospitality background and skills related to working in the hospitality industry. A job seeker has put their information in Employ Florida, including that the job seeker is currently looking for a full-time job and has experience in the hospitality industry. The employer will see the candidate's information when the employer conducts a search on who wants full-time work. The employer can reach out to the job seeker to see if they want to interview for the job opening. This example shows why we encourage job seekers to create a profile, enter their background information, and create a resume in the Employ Florida system. This is the Employ Florida login screen. It can be found through the Department of Economic Opportunities, or DEO's website, or by searching Employ Florida through your favorite search engine. During this lesson, we reviewed an introduction to the job order process 
and the Employ Florida system. In the next lesson, we will focus on creating a profile in the Employ Florida system.